Good job. Good job. Uh, welcome, welcome back. back. Uh, this problem is solved. Problem. Look your, at this. Your Reynolds wrap gets all messed up, but you have fixed it now. You know I love a good uh, puzzle. All right, so you want to rip that off? Here or we yeah. Can just do this. All right. Yeah, do that. There we go. Okay. Good job. Good job. Good job. Okay, we got this. Oh, there we go. Okay, so okay. what we need to do is we're going to start making the sauce, and I think if we put those on a plate and cover it, they'll still be cooking because it's going to be hot. I'm going to turn the heat down a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I think we should for the sauce. We don't want it to uh, scorch. Okay. Okay, perfect. Right. Let's set this off just for okay. a second. Set this. We'll let it heat. We're going to put them back in. We're going to put them back in. I'm going to set them back here so okay. they can be cooking. So now let's make a sauce in the same pan. With Here's all the good do. flavors. Yeah. We need to melt two tablespoons of butter. All right. That's about what we have here. Oh, gosh, a little more. Are we going to need butter for anything else? Uh, let me double check. Uh, I don't think so. This is barely over two tablespoons. I say put it all. We'll use it. Because if just we don't, it. we'll, it'll just go to waste. Melt the butter in the remaining cooking juices. Okay, then we're going to, yes, perfect. Okay. There we go. Then we need to melt the butter, and then we're going to add the garlic, onion, Italian seasonings, and red chili pepper. Okay. So for garlic, we're going to need six cloves. So is it three teaspoons? So that would be... Six teaspoons. Yes. No. One Six teaspoon? teaspoon? One teaspoon. It says one no. teaspoon equals a clove. One oh, teaspoon. really? One teaspoon, one clove. Oh, wow. That's what it says on the Wowza. Wow. Okay. So six of those. All right, let's get it back over here. There we go. One. Wowza. Okay. I'm okay with that. Oh, gosh, that is so hot still. Isn't it? Okay. There we go. Oh, but, but now, ooh, ooh that's, that's gonna burn. Yep, that's gonna burn. Yep, good call, good call. Now, can you add, Cal, the, the minced onion? We have one onion that's been minced. It's a, it's a smaller onion. Small oh, right yellow onion, one yes. Whole thing? That's whole, that whole thing. There it is. Oh, gosh, I can't believe that garlic is burnt. I mean, we turned that down to like I know, we low. really did. Here, you can stir that. It's Let me like see what else we, we need to add. You know, we need some heat, but we don't want it to burn. Yeah. You know? Okay, Italian seasonings. Here we go. And we need to add one teaspoon of this. Okay, here you go. It's your okay, teaspoon right you. there. I wore my bell sleeves just for our cooking segment well, today. Well, I'd have it no other way. <laughs> I thought about it when I left the house, but I'm like, you know what? I'll just tuck them up. It's all good. And then we need one teaspoon of red crushed chili peppers. Oh, this sounds like a good sauce. It smells fragrant yes. already. It smells amazing. Fragrant, I love it. Yeah, so it says to um, stir it until fragrant, about one minute. Okay. And then we're gonna add some uh, chicken juice. Oh, we really are? Yes. I was gonna make a joke about that because oh, it looked no. like chicken juice. We got some here. chicken juice. I love you know how we love to have our We fresh... love our chicken juice. That is my recipe for all things good for you. Have one cup of chicken juice. Now, Kelly. In the morning before you go to work. Did you have your chicken juice this morning? Yes, no, I didn't. I'm just making sure. I want to have it now. Okay, we added the garlic, the onion, Italian seasoning, red chili pepper. Yes, got it. Okay. And we're going to add in the chicken stock, the chicken juice, and yeah. we're going to let it reduce. Yeah. That's kind of a joke, guys. I know chicken stock sounds much better. But this is go. not a super fancy kitchen. Is that, do you feel it's fragrant enough now? I do, yeah. There we go. We can turn that up a little bit. And that, by the way, was a third cup. Okay. One third cup. One and third it says cup. to reduce. So oh, reduce it says that. to reduce? Oh, yes. Well, it says to reduce it to allow to reduce a little. That's actually verbatim what it says. Okay. Reduce heat to low, and then we're going to add the half and half after that reduces. Okay. I have turned it down to two. There we go. Well, it was so hot there for a it while, was. though. It what really are you going to do? I know. Feels like it's not doing anything now. <laughs> we can never, well, it's starting to blow there. It's starting okay. to blow there. Okay. We'll leave it, it where we We can at. never have, have I know, it. there's no in between here. No in between. And guys, I will admit too, I didn't look at this recipe till this morning. And at the very end, Kelly and I were setting up, and I was reading, I'm like, ah! Oh, could have had some cauliflower rice. 
It says serve over steamed veggies, zucchini noodles, or rice cauliflower. Yeah. Didn't even see that until right now. That's all right. Until this That's morning, right. and I was like, well, too late for that. We're really keto up in here. Yeah, we are. Oh, gosh, too. Speaking of unketo, I saw yeah. a recipe on TikTok yesterday. What is it? She basically made, okay, scalloped potatoes. Yeah. But she put it in a pan where it's, it's not creamy, though. It's like compounded scalloped potatoes. Okay. And it's compacted in there, in like a, a little baking sheet. Yes. Then she baked it, then put it in the freezer and froze it. She took it out and cut it in, in uh, sticks and deep fried them. Oh, seriously. And they looked so amazing. It was like deep fried potato sticks. Wow. And they were like this tall. There's nothing more comforting than potatoes. <sighs> Don't you think? I love them. I do too. Love them. I love them too. Now tell me if you think that's reduced enough to where you can add the yes, heavy cream. I think we add the heavy cream now. Okay, we're gonna add the heavy Ready. cream and bring the creamy sauce to a gentle simmer. All right. And this is to add salt and pepper, which I think is just like oh, taste. Okay, I, sure. I don't know. Oh, I love this. Now, can I turn the heat up a little bit now? Sure. Or no? Yeah. And you know what, Pass? If you want to keep stirring, I'll add just a little bit of salt and pepper. Oh, sure. Um, or I can stir, and you can just add okay. some. And just add a little salt and pepper, and we're going to bring this to a simmer. Simmer down now. Simmer up a little bit, please. <laughs> yeah, I know. Do something here. Could you already. just do something? Do you remember that one recipe we made a couple weeks ago and you and I were like, oh my God, so salty. Everybody else yes, that tried it. Yes, everybody in the studio loved it. Yeah. What was up with that? What was up with that? I do not know. And as we were both like, whoa. Well, ah. like, yes, I have to admit that it's too salty. TJ loved it. Kaylee loved it. Mm -hmm. Who else loved it? I think Adam, Adam loved it. it. Um, Natalie Nunn loved it. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe the flavors just settled in a little bit more after we tried it. I just, yeah, I took that first bite and I was like, wow, wow, wow. I'm like, wowza. Okay, so we need to bring this to a simmer. We, had, we added the salt and pepper. Then what we're gonna do is add the spinach. Now? Oh wait, no, no, hold. No, it said to oh. simmer this first. It's, simmer! Simmer down now! Please! I'm turning it up. <laughs> trying to make it. It's on high now, guys. Yeah, oh, um, it's starting to do something. Add the spinach leaves, allow to wilt, then we're gonna stir in the Parmesan. I think we're getting behind. I think we better. We're, we're really behind. Right, so we're we're do the spinach need? first and then the Parmesan. Yeah. Okay, it's starting to now. We got it now. All the whole... Yes, the whole Boy, thing. that's a lot, but it does go. It does cook down a lot. Okay. So, guys, during this commercial, we're going to add the spinach, the parm, and then we're going to add the pork chops back in. Yeah. All, All within right, this commercial good. break, because we got to get this done. Because <laughs> we got to get this done, guys. Okay. We'll be back. That looks beautiful. Yeah.